okay welcome back guys in this video i'm going to upload the image into our firebase fire storage and at the same time i'm going to save the downloadable link of that image into our firebase fire store okay so first of all before going into our main activity i'm going to open the console.firebase.google.com and from here i'm going to select the test firebase project which we have just created and first of all go to your storage and into the storage click on get started and here just click on got it let it create the bucket after creating the storage just click on rules and here change it to true just click on true select true from here and click on publish in a seconds your app changes will be published and then next click on databases and from here choose Create database of Cloud Firestore, start in test mode and click enable. Let it create the security rules. After creating the security rules, we are done with our console.firebase.google.com. In the next step, let me go back into our Android Studio. Okay, after that, storage reference and I'm going to name it storage reference and other one should be Firebase Firestore reference and I'm going to name it Firebase Object Firebase Firestore. In the next step, go into your on create folder and in the on create folder, I'm going to initialize both of these variables with the Firebase storage dot is get instant dot get, dot get reference. But as you can see inside our storage of the Firebase, there is no folder right here. So I'm going to create a folder in here and I'm going to name it image folder okay in the next step i'm going to initialize the object firebase firestore which is equal to firebase firestore dot get instance that's it okay so we have initialized both of our variables which we had just created over here in the next step i'm going to create a method that will be used to upload images inside our firebase storage so i'm going to say public wide upload image and to make it clickable i'm going to pass the object of view then surrounding the code with try and catch block okay so first thing you need to do as we are going to get the image name from here this added text this added text should not be null okay so in the very first step i'm going to put the uh, condition that not equal to upload added text dot get text dot to string dot is empty that this upload pick added text should not be empty and at the same time our image location path should not be equal to null okay and if user put null values inside these are left the added text empty then we are going to call the toast please provide name for the image okay in the next step i'm going to create the name for the image with the extension that we would save into our firebase storage okay so for that purpose i'm going to create a string over here string name of image would equal to we will be getting the image name from upload pick adder text dot get text dot to string plus we will provide the extension for this image okay to get the extension for this image location path i'm going to create another method that would be private wide get extension and here i'm going to pass the uri object for which i will be getting the extension let me surround it with try catch as well okay so first of all i'm going to call the content object of content resolver i would be calling content resolver equal to get content resolver next i would be calling the mime type map and calling the object of mime type map would equal to get mime type map dot get singleton after that i would return the object but as you see the return type is white i'm going to change this to string so return object 
mime type dot get extension from mime type type and here object content resolver dot get type and we're going to get the type for this uri that we have passed over here okay in case this block does not run we will return null okay that's it so now i'm going to call this method <coughs> in here get extension and here i will pass image location that we will get from our this variable okay so in the next step i'm going to create another storage reference storage reference this will be image reference that we will store would equal to object storage reference dot child here i'm going to pass the name of the image that we will be storing okay in the next step you have to call the upload task and create the object of upload task equals to image reference dot put file here pass the location for the file that you want to store after that call the object upload task dot continue with the task and new continue with the task and change this task to URI and over here you have to also change it to URI okay in case we get any exception that would be task dot is not successful then we will throw task dot get exception and will return image reference dot get download it url after that just add on complete listener new on complete listener and here close it if task is successful and in case if Toss is not successful. We will toast the reason behind why task is not successful. Is dot dot task dot get exception dot to string. And if the task is successful, then we will add the downloadable link of this into our cloud Firestore. So for that purpose, first of all, I'm going to create a map in which I will be storing the image link string string object map equals to new hash map then object map that put and here i would be giving the name that would be url i will pass test start get result and this method will return a link to our image that we have into our firebase storage okay next thing i'm going to store this link into our firebase fire storage for that purpose let me call firebase fire storage dot collection and i would be saying that collection is links dot document and document would be the name of the image that we will get from the upload pick et dot get text dot to string and then set and here i will be pass object of map that we want to store after that add on success listener new on success listener and i will be calling a toast over here that image is uploaded in case we get any exception or error then new on failure listener toast on failure listener fails to upload image okay at the end just close it after that at the end of this I'm going to call this image upload method at the on click of our this button on click upload image okay so this is the code that we are using inside our application okay the next thing I'm going to do is to just run this application so our emulator is ready just going to choose the image storage let me select this image and provide let me provide the name for this i would be say why and click on upload image
okay so as you can see that image is uploaded into our storage let me get back into our storage so that we can see that the images are being uploaded or not okay here you can see that our image image folder has been created then just click on that and you will see that our boy image is stored into our application and to get the downloadable link we will click over here file location then you can see this is the downloadable link but at the same time we have stored our link into our database just click on database over here and here the link collection has been created with one document which is boy and this is the link that we have stored into our fire store and we will use this link to download our image back into our application so i'm going to add few more images into it choose image from here and i'm going to change it to wolf then upload image and you can see that a new document is created over here now i'm going to select another image that is for man okay click on upload so our image is uploaded in here and if we click on the storage you can see that all of the images has been uploaded into our fire source so that's it for this video in the next video i'm going to show you guys that how to get these images back into our application so see you guys in the next video